What is going on everyone? Welcome to Detail Projects. In today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys the latest project I've been working on, and that is the IK Multi TR1 spray bottles. Um, and also, um, we're gonna be talking about the custom uh, labels that you see on the bottles as well, made by Lex Garage. So in this video, we're gonna be going over the bottles, we're talking about the bottles a little bit, we'll put the bottles to the test uh, for you guys to get a visual. Um, also, we're going to be talking about the labels. Uh, we are going to, uh, I'll be showing you guys the installation process. And then we're going to be answering some questions in the end of the video. So let's dive right in. All right, so before we dive into the uh, product description, let's just take a minute to appreciate how photogenic and how beautiful these bottles look. All right, guys, so IK is a company out of Spain and they're well known uh, for making high-end sprayers. Um, you may be familiar with the uh, IK Foam 1.5 and the IK Sprayer 1.5. Those are their first gens uh, sprayers and they're very well known in the detailing world. Uh, now these are very high quality. Uh, they're made of very high quality materials and they have served me well. Now, their latest addition to their lineup is the uh, IK Multi TR1, and this is a just a regular spray bottle. However, it's a very, very durable uh, spray bottle. It's made out of the same materials as uh, the 1.5s, and uh, it's a very sturdy, very heavy duty um, spray bottle. The price is $15.95 Canadian, and uh, so the capacity is a, it's a one liter or 35 ounces. It has a level indicator in ounces here, and it has a level uh, level indicator in milliliters on this side. Uh, it comes with a product ID label. Um, it's green or red, so you can identify your chemicals uh, accordingly. Uh, I won't be using this, however, because I have these beautiful Lex Garage uh, labels on mine. So, but they are they do offer those, so which is really nice. Um, it comes with a really nice sprayer um, and it's fully adjustable. We're going to be put into the test right away here for you guys to uh, to see how it uh, automizes. And so, yeah, so it weighs about uh, 18 grams um, and so it's not too, too heavy. So the uh, tier one is designed uh, for use with um, diluted acids, uh, alkalines and water based uh, chemicals. It is not suitable for hydrocarbons or uh, any type of uh, oil-based solvents. So if you are planning on using such chemicals, they do offer the uh, IK uh, Multi Tier 1, or sorry, it's the Tier 1 HC. And it's the same exactly concept bottle. However, the um, wherever the black parts are here, uh, they are gray so the bottom's gray and then the top here the neck is gray and it comes with a different sprayer and I believe it's a white sprayer uh, but it's the same capacity uh, same concept so if you're looking into any type of lubricants or any type of uh, um, oil-based uh, solvents this is not a fit for for that so be mindful of that all right, so having said all that, uh, let's dive right in and uh, show you guys real quick how the bottle performs. All right, so uh, on the uh, nozzle, um, it does show, it does have an indicator open and close. So counterclockwise, this just shuts completely. So there's no spray coming out. And uh, now the more you adjust it, uh, the more mist you get. So this is kinda, so this is where I would set it personally. This is the mist that it creates. And then it goes leaner, so more of a stream. And as you see, it goes pretty far. Um, the one thing that I noticed that is not very ergonomic for me is the uh, the sprayer. Um, if I try to rest the uh, this piece on between my thumb, it is not very comfortable. Um, I noticed that uh, it puts a lot of pressure in between here. 
when I uh, when I spray so because it because it, it just adds that pressure here so what I've learned to do is uh, hold it like this and so yeah this is a better way for me to uh, to work with the uh, the sprayer so as you see very nice it atomizes really nice Now let's talk about the uh, custom labels made by Lex Garage. And let me start off by saying that the minute that I saw these labels with the bottle combo, it was a must have for me because I've been looking for something like this for as long as I remember. Um, I've always wanted to have the same uh, bottles with clean labeling. And the minute I saw that, I couldn't ask for anything more. So I reached out to Lex Garage uh, on Instagram and uh, let me tell you, like amazing customer service, uh, so responsive, uh, effective communicator. Uh, I have not enough good words to say. He went above and beyond uh, with his customer service. Um, now, let me tell you what he offers. So for these labels, he offers them as a six pack and uh, you can customize them to your desire. You can you know, name your bottles how you please. Now, max characters uh, are, is, it's, uh, so for each uh, label, it has a, a limit of nine characters max uh, because of the uh, fitment, uh, uh, of the, uh, for fitment purposes. So um, having said that, I would recommend uh, when you purchase your six pack, uh, to double it up just in case you know you mess anything up or something goes wrong you always have a backup uh, that would be my suggestion um, now the price for a six pack uh, is $16 US shipped within the US and $18 US internationally shipped so that is a such a reasonably priced uh, labels and uh, like I said customer service was amazing um, and uh, the material of the labels, it's a really, really high quality matte black uh, with a durability of uh, six years outdoors. Um, now, the only thing that you got to be mindful is if you're going to be using any type of adhesive removers or any tar removers, be careful this doesn't land on here because this could potentially damage the adhesive of the labels. Um, Lex Garage also offers instructions. So whenever you buy the product, um, he goes above and beyond and he uh, sends a handwritten card, a thank you, appreciation. And also he sends you uh, instructions of how to uh, apply the labels onto your bottles. And so I made a quick video just showing you guys how to, uh, um, how to, uh, apply the labels onto the bottles and so pretty much is you got to give it a good clean and uh, then uh, it, it requires a little bit of patience so you got to be a little bit patient when you're applying it and uh, peeling it off uh, however it turned out great so it didn't take me much time uh, I just took my time though uh, adjusting everything and so as you see in the video uh, you just got to be a little bit patient and uh, line everything up uh, use a uh, credit card to or a, any type of card to kind of um, uh, go over the uh, the label before you peel off the top layer and uh, there you go you get the end result so very easy very straightforward installation however it does require patience and I, like I said I suggest getting maybe a second set of uh, duplicate labels just in case something goes wrong
All right, so before we wrap up the video, let's just answer a couple questions. Uh, so is this bottle worth $15.95 Canadian? And the answer is absolutely yes. To me, the quality of the, the bottle is, is uh, amazing. Uh, it's worth every penny. It's gonna last a very, very long time. It's very durable. And so it is worth the $15.95. Now, is it necessary? The answer is no, it's not. It's not necessary because you could get away with any type of spray bottle and, you know, execute any task and they're going to perform the same. Um, so that really comes down to what are you looking for? So for me, I've always been looking for a clean setup. I've always been looking for a very durable, high quality spray bottle to match my detailing arsenal. And I found it and I would buy it again. Uh, so the combination with the labels and the uh, spray bottles, to me, in my opinion, is the perfect match and uh, I highly, highly recommend it. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. As always, comment, like, subscribe, and thank you so much for all the support and we'll catch you on the next one. Talk to you later.